Um, I started swimming at the age of seven. Um, I, my older brother was on the swim team and my mom had swam in high school, so it was just kind of a part of what my family did, so that's how I got into it. I think the idea of just reaching full potential as an athlete is there. That's what we're all here to do. And for me, a big thing is contributing to a team. The fact that we're going into the PSAC right now and have a good shot at winning it. I mean, everyone wants to contribute as much as possible. So for me, to do the best that I can to help my team win, that that's really a driving factor. I think about how if I'm in a race and I feel that pain, I'm going to have to push through even more so than just in the workout. So the, the harder you work at practice, the more prepared you're going to be when the race time comes and that much you're going to be that much further ahead of whoever you're competing against. The coaches are very supportive. Bridget and Stu are the best. Whenever during a workout, they're always like just telling you, keep going, keep going, do the best you can. And they're really supportive, like on days where you're not feeling it, they under, they understand what it's like, to, how some days are better than others, but they're always there to kind of push you to that next step and say, you can do this. And I think any swimmer can relate to being in like a big meet situation and maybe starting off with not a good race or messing something up in your first race, but in a meet scenario, you have to go on to the next event and in that sort of situation, you just kind of have to move on to the next next race, get ready for your next thing, and not let not let it get to your head. A lot of the swimming is mental, and you just kind of have to mentally prepare for each race. My favorite event, I'd probably have to say the 500 free, just because it's kind of I I'm a freestyler, so I swim here. I've been swimming anything from like a 50 free to a, a mile, so it's quite a span. The 500 is kind of right in the middle there, and I think. That's one of my stronger events. It's fun to do. You just kind of, it's its like a sprint, but it's a very smart, controlled race. You have to really, I don't know, have a good race plan going into it and not be afraid to take it out like a sprint, but be able to hold on and have, um, hold on to a pace there. So I think it kind of is like a hybrid of all the freestyle events. Um, I would say just how close the team is and how well everyone works together. And, when we've gone through tough situations this year as a team, everyone's kind of all been on board together, like overcoming challenges together. And the fact that everyone's there to support each other is just going to make going into meets so much easier. And we've seen the success so far, and now we're just really excited to go into PSAX and try to win. So My expectations are that everyone's going to be really excited to swim and go in there really hoping to win like we have a lot to prove and it would be a big part of this program's history if we could come out with a win in PSAC but even the fact that we're just competing for first right now is awesome and I think that's going to really psych everyone up and I think we're going to see a lot of fast swims out of it all so as long as everyone's putting in the best effort and is there for the team and there to try to prove themselves I think it's going to be a good meet.